the second classification of lipid is compound lipid compound lipid consists of fatty acids plus alcohol plus additional group the additional group in compound lipid may be carbohydrates it may be protein or it may be phosphoric acid there are three examples of compound lipid number 1 is phospholipids the second one is glycolipid and the third one is lipoprotein phospholipid as the name indicates phospholipid consists of lipids and phosphoric acid the components of lipids and phospholipids are fatty acids plus alcohol phospholipids in addition to lipids and phosphoric acid also contain nitrogen base <coughs> lipids are the fatty acids and alcohol फॉस्फोलिपर्स में जो हमारे पास अल्कोहल हैं दो तरह की हो सकती हैं या तो ये अल्कोहल हमारे पास ग्लाइसरोल हो सकता है या फिर स्फिंगोसिन हो सकता है अल्कोहल या ग्लाइसरोल हो सकता है या फिर स्फिंगोसिन हो सकता है स्फिंगोसिन एग्जाम्पल्स जो हमारे पास फॉस्फोलिपर्स की एग्जाम्पल हैं वो हैं लेसिथिन सेफलिन कार्डियोलिपिन फॉस्फेटिडल फॉसफेटिडल स्टीन एंड फॉसफेटिडल इनोसिटोल अल्कोहल जो हमारे पास फॉसोलिपिड में अल्कोहल होता है या फिर वो ग्लिसरोल हो सकता है या फिर वो स्विंगोसिन हो सकता है इसकी बेस पर हमारे पास जो फॉसोलिपिड्स हैं वो दो तरह के होते हैं या फिर वो ग्लिसरो फॉसफोलिपिड होते हैं या फिर वो स्विंगो फॉसफोलिपिड हो सकते हैं ऐसे ऐसे हमारे पास फॉसफोलिपिड जिनमें अल्कोहल एज अ ग्लिसरोल यूज होता है उन्हें हम कहते हैं ग्लिसरो फॉस्फोलिपिड्स और ऐसे लिपिड्स जिनमें अल्कोहल एज अ स्पिंगोसिन यूज होता है उन्हें हम कहते हैं स्पिंगो फॉस्फोलिपिड्स now come to the next that is glycolipid as the name indicates glycolipids consist of lipids plus carbohydrates <coughs> the components of lipids and glycolipids are fatty acid and the alcohol is sphingosin there are two examples of glycolipid one is ganglioxides and the second one is cerebrosides the third one is lipoprotein lipoprotein as the name indicates it consists of lipids and proteins lipids and proteins and the examples of lipoproteins are low density lipids very low density lipids high density lipids and chylomicrons
the next one is derived lipid the third category of lipid is derived lipids derived lipids are obtained by the hydrolysis of either simple lipid or compound lipid simple or compound lipids derived lipids and the examples of derived lipids are fatty acids steroids 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 may be other estrogen hormone progesterone hormone oxytocin cortical etc and eicosanoids are also the example of derived lipids which we will discuss later in this series and keto bodies which are obtained from the acetyl coenzyme a Hydro derived lipids are obtained by the hydrolysis of simple or compound lipids. The examples of derived lipids are either fatty acids, steroids, estrogen, progesterone, oxytocin, cortisol, etc., eicosanoids, eicosanoids, which we'll discuss later in this chapter, and the keto bodies acetyl coenzyme A. And the fourth series is miscellaneous lipids. Miscellaneous lipids are not are contain the properties of lipids. The examples of miscellaneous lipids are squalene. It is formed during the synthesis of cholesterol. Squalene is formed during the synthesis of cholesterol. and carotenoids carotenoids are the pigments in the plant cell that is carotenoids <laughs>